Luis, I realized something the other day. I absolutely have to get stronger. And you'd like me to train you then? I see. Well then, we'll have to place you in a more suitable environment. I believe these individuals will assist you in your training. You can repay me by finding out what Pan's favorite snack is and bringing it to me. Uh, thank you very much. I can't wait to get started with my training. Pic Piccolo? Why are you here? I brought him in from Kanton City. We'll need him for your training. Huh? Kanton City? Pay no mind. You needn't know of such things right now. Wait, I know this place. This is where we fought Nappa and Vegeta. That's right. One of the remaining Cybermen tried to attack me. That was far too easy an exercise for you. Let's continue then. Vegeta has been fixated on being my dad since then. If only I was as powerful back then, I would have known. He just keeps getting stronger as the fight goes on. But I'm not losing to him. I'm gonna keep getting stronger until I surpass even the Vegeta of our time. <laughs> I'd be interested in seeing just how much you could do against him. You've done it now. You don't seem to know how scary I can be. I'm not the scared little boy I was when I fought you before. Oh, <laughs> you're right. He certainly does have a face that would scare any child. Well, I'm not scared now. If I had actually beaten Vegeta, I guess that would mean Trunks would never have been born. <laughs> I'm sure that timeline exists somewhere. An interesting thought. Right. This is what I wore when I fought Cell. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad. And since I've got nothing else better to do right now, why not waste a few more moments with you? I got carried away. And my dad suffered as a result. should be able to beat you easily. If only I'd been able to control my emotions better back then. Very well. Little by little, you will get you to, as they say, know thyself. Maybe... Maybe I've made some progress. Last time I 
wore this get up was <laughs> but this is uh, you know <laughs> oh, God, geez. I actually didn't get this one to pick a lot. But yeah, this takes me back. Whoa! This guy's serious! I'm getting really hungry. Your younger brother was quite the powerhouse at that age. He is. I couldn't have asked for a better brother. But I'm not letting him know. Let's do this, go -Ken. Go down yet. This is, uh, wait, I know this. It was when I went on my first date with Videl, I, I think. A bittersweet memory? Or perhaps just a sweet one? Ugh, I'm kind of embarrassed now. That was pretty dastardly, Weiss. Oh my, I must say I was only trying to help someone worth protecting. Wouldn't you agree? I'll do whatever it takes. My family. I will protect them. Thank you for taking the time to train with me. I feel like I'm ready to fight when the time comes. I can think of no better way to cap off my training than by fighting you. It appears Gohan now knows why I've brought you here with you. I'd like you to put Gohan and his training to the test. I'll leave a mark. I'm not done yet. The match is only just getting started. Ah! He grows stronger the more he fights. That's the saying for you. I dare say it may be Gohan here who surpasses Lord Beerus rather than Goku or Vegeta. Whoa. You're great. Seriously. No way. I can still do this. I have to keep training. Your strength is sufficient enough. Within you is the burning desire to protect your family. Like Goku, you are prepared to fight, though he's a special case. People like you two have all the strength you need. <laughs> you really think so? Oh, right, about that snack. Be sure to bring it next time.
Very impressive. A rare genius, in fact. 